we have another Jamaican dancehall artist who is definitely not among the smartest. Now on your screen is a very popular yet controversial Jamaican dancehall artist who goes by the name of Jashi. Now I'm pretty sure people must be wondering, so we're on the spot news media, I come with right now, Jashi. Jashi has been under the radar for quite some time. And indeed, he has been under the radar for quite some time. But as we all know, most Jamaican artists seems to be in a position where they have to prove their street credibility. So they always seem to be among a certain type of individuals, individuals of questionable character. Now Jassy has found himself in a similar situation. So what took place last week, Wednesday, sometime last week, Wednesday, a man from the Grand Spen community, Short Road Road, you don't know that general area there where Jashi mother have him shop. A man who goes by the name of Romy, who has a shop in the same vicinity, had a verbal turn physical altercation with Josh's mother. It is said that Romy, who is now deceased by the way, basically dashed some water upon Josh's mother. Joshi never take so kind to that. None of us would. So Joshi got page Romy. So after Joshi page Romy, some little goons who is said to be importees from Spanish town with their own Joshi, decide to say they might go defend the thing for the artist. Because Romy run with Joshi when time Joshi got page him. I make him know say no man to him thing. So the little goons them hear that now. And go dash with Romy. Yeah man, the man them go slap some can in a Romy body. Billy has spread him out like a sheet round there. Along short to the road. Leaving him lifeless. So basically Romy is no longer among the land of the living. Now Romy have a brother. A known Nakis and Clappis, a real old dirty kind of boy from out of Grand Spain. Now, this brother is definitely no stranger to the ones and ones them, and most definitely no stranger to the police, as he has spent several months in police lockup for a series of atrocities committed by him. The man in question is known as Pokey. Now, Pokey is somewhere in the United States among you, members of the diaspora. After spending quite a few years behind bars, he got off his case and decided to say, I'm going to take it to the skies. So he's presently in America. Now, Pokey not take too kindly to the fact that his brother lost his life because of goons aligned to Joshi. And the side say, Joshi got to go. I went and we said, Go, you know, we don't mean say, he might go pull a door and say, Joshi walk through that and go on. Joshi got to go simply means dirt settings, shut eye country land is the order of the day type of thing. That is what Pokey definitely a defend. Now, the ones and ones, them, the elders in the Grand Spen community, I try to hold the thing together. But Pokey is hell-bent on taking Joshi from out of the game permanently. Now, given the fact that Joshi is from the Grand Spen community, Joshi would have known the character of Pokey and know say Pokey is a man where we definitely clap him with himself if he was here. And he knows that he is among some other powerhouses that is supporting him in the United States. So it's easy to get some man run up with some strap and come dirt Joshi. Now Joshi is in hiding. Take away himself from out of the place. And is in a parish in the western part of our island. So now Joshi 
bite off a little bit more than we can chew. I just hope that the authorities can definitely nip this in the bud before this thing get out of hand. Because we all know when the criminal elements in that particular community of Grand Spain decide to start wreak havoc, dozens usually drop like fly. Yeah, man. So a word to the wise is always sufficient. Jamaican dancehall artists stick to music and Lego the bad man thing. Because Jashi, even though you come from Grand Spain, you don't know nothing about the art of war. You don't know nothing about badness. You grow around the badness, yes, and everybody know that. But you yourself no bad. You know some man like Pokey. Dangerous youth. And we not glorify him nor nothing. We just speak it as it is. So you bite off a little bit more than what you can chew this time. Let's just hope the authorities can intervene and quell this thing here before it gets out of hand. So residents of the Grand Spain community, if you never know, now you know. Yeah, man.